lymphangitis causes and symptoms lymphangitis is an infection of the lymph vessels that carry lymphatic fluid throughout the body lymphangitis usually requires antibiotic treatment skin infections are the most common cause of lymphangitis the body's lymph fluid and the lymphatic system help a person to fight infections usually lymph fluid travels to an infection site to deliver lymphocytes to help fight the infection lymphocytes are white blood cells sometimes infected lymph fluid in one area of the body travels to the lymph vessels causing lymphangitis in this video learn more about the causes and symptoms of lymphangitis causes lymphangitis is a type of secondary infection which means it happens because of another infection when the infection travels from the original site to the lymph vessels the vessels become inflamed and infected bacterial infections are the most common cause of lymphangitis lymphangitis due to a viral or fungal infection is also possible any injury that allows a virus bacteria or fungus to enter the body can cause an infection that leads to lymphangitis some possible culprits include puncture wounds such as from stepping on a nail or other sharp object untreated or severe skin infections such as cellulitis insect bites and stings a wound that requires stitches infected surgical wounds sporotrichosis a fungal skin infection common among gardeners symptoms people with lymphangitis may notice red streaks extending from the site of an injury to areas where there are a lot of lymph glands such as the armpits or groin unexplained red streaks on any area of the body could also be a sign of lymphangitis especially in a person who has an existing skin infection other symptoms of lymphangitis can include a recent wound that is not healing feeling sick or weak a fever chills a headache low energy and loss of appetite swelling near an injury or the groin or armpits lymphangitis can spread to the blood if left untreated this life threatening infection called sepsis may cause a very high fever flu like symptoms and even organ failure a person who feels very ill following an injury or who has a high fever and symptoms of lymphangitis seek emergency medical attention people with weak immune systems may be more vulnerable to lymphangitis having certain conditions such as diabetes hiv or cancer or taking drugs that suppress the immune system including chemotherapy drugs may all increase the risk of lymphangitis people with signs of skin infections who have these conditions should speak to their doctor diagnosis a doctor may suspect lymphangitis based on a person's symptoms alone if a person has swollen lymph nodes red streaks extending from an injury or other signs of infection a doctor may begin treatment with antibiotics they will also typically conduct a thorough exam to find the source of the original infection since this can help with choosing the right treatment often a doctor will prescribe antibiotics while waiting for the results of a culture a culture of the journey can reveal whether the infection is bacterial 
viral or fungal and and which medication will be most effective with the results of a culture a doctor may change the treatment or add further medication to the person's treatment plan in some cases a doctor might also perform a biopsy of any swollen lymph nodes to rule out other conditions blood work may also be helpful especially if the cause of the infection is unclear treatment lymphangitis can spread quickly so doctors typically recommend aggressive treatment of the underlying infection in most cases a person will need antibiotics to treat a bacterial infection intravenous antibiotics can deliver the medication faster so a person may need to receive intravenous antibiotics in the hospital or at a doctor's office if the infection is fungal or viral a doctor will prescribe antifungal or antiviral medications if the first round of medication does not kill the infection a person may need another round of medication rarely an individual may require surgery to remove infected tissue lymphangitis can be very painful so help with the pain a person can try applying warm compresses to the injury and areas with red streaks using anti-inflammatory medications such as ibuprofen taking prescription strength pain relievers from a doctor 